guys, Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Gonna break down this really nice Jack Johnson song for you guys right now. Uh, also, real quick, appreciate you supporting me with Marty Music. In fact, I have a new Patreon, which has a bunch of really cool features and bonuses that you can get. Check out the link in the info below. I appreciate that. All right, let's break it down. All right, let's start with the intro. Check this out. We've got a few frets, fret numbers to keep track of. We've got the 10th fret, and it's all gonna be on the D and G string. So you've got 10th fret, 12th fret, back to 10, back to seven, and then five. And the rhythm starts like this. So I'm covering the 10th fret, I pick the D string, and I'm covering the D and G together with one finger, and I go. So I'm hitting the 10th, sliding to 12. And then I hit the G string when it's up to the 12th fret. And then I immediately hit D and slide back down. So it's always gonna be D, G, D, G, D, G. You see that, look at the right hand. So that was 10, 12, 10, 7, 5. And when I get to that 5, I don't hit that G right away, the rhythm changes. Do da do da do da da do da do da da do da da do da da do da 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 So once again, now it's more of a G than the D string slide. From here. G, D, uh, 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 D, uh. And then when you get to that 10th fret, you're hitting the G, D, but then the A string quickly, like that. And so that's just 10th fret. And then it's down to the 8th fret A string. And now I'm playing an F major chord right here with the A shape barred on the 8th fret. So the top of the intro, slow. Now the chords are F major, then you just move the bass note down. And also he's very famous for the Jack Johnson chuck, where you get that percussive slap. You can get it with muting with your right palm and then hitting with the pick. So you get that percussive slap. It also helps to kind of control it with your left hand as well. But let's go through the chords, then we'll add the rhythm. So you have F major, then just the bass line going down to the E note, seventh fret A string, so. Then D minor, so it's fifth fret with the A minor shape. Then C major, which is just like that F major shape, but now root on the third fret A string. So you have F major, F over E, D minor, C major. Then we're gonna grab E root bar chords now. So B flat major, which I'm barring across the sixth fret with my index finger. That's the E major shape right there. And then we're gonna do a similar thing with the F chord, or that we did with the F chord, and the index just goes down to the fifth fret. don't want those high E string or B in there. So that's uh, B flat, B flat over A. Then we go down to the third fret bar chord and it's G minor. So it's an E minor shape like that. 
and then right back to C major, which I'm gonna play here on the eighth fret because then it goes back to that again and starts over. Now he doesn't stick to one exact rhythm, but if you think of it as down, up, 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 and you've got this. So I went down, up, chuck. And then immediately up again, down, up, chuck, up, down, up, chuck, up, down, up, chuck, up, down. Now we have the chorus, which is just B flat major, up to C, B flat. But there's a little anticipation that's the B major to the B. So you're playing that E shaped bar chord on the seventh fret and you're sliding it down to the sixth. So check it out. Not on the way up. Slower. And then you're right back to the top. Now there is a little bridge that we have to learn. No, nothing, nothing new really, but just a little uh, new combination of chords. So for the bridge, think of the chorus rhythm, you know? And what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with a G minor, which we already were playing in the song, to a C major. You can play it right there, you can play it right there, you can play it right there. For me, it's right next door, so I'm just gonna do that, so. just switches to B flat instead of G minor. Alright, there was the lesson. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you'd like to see any lessons or songs that you'd like to learn, let me know in the comments below. While you're down there, don't forget to like and subscribe right here to Marty Music. Thanks again so much, and I hope to see you in another lesson real soon.